I'm Kelsey Wingert, and you're watching On Deck with Tyler Redman. Hi, this is Phil Necro. You're watching On Deck with Tyler Redman. This is Mark the Banks, and I'm on deck with Tyler Redman. Hey guys, welcome into the first ever live edition of On Deck. As you can see, I'm not in the typical studio that you, well, typically see me in. With that being said, we have now a live update of something going on in the trade market that I think will excite all of you. Atlanta Braves are reportedly now offering four years to Josh Donaldson. I cannot verify this. I cannot say that it is completely true. I can tell you that it is on TomahawkTake.com. Uh, it's posted by Alan Carpenter. And what I'm going to do now is read you the article. You can take with it what you want. Um, but it makes me excited. I'll, I'll tell you that much. So basically, two former general managers, Jim Bowden and Steve Phillips, are reporting this morning that a Donaldson signing delay is about a continued bidding escalation. The Atlanta Braves, for now, are still on the hunt. All these teams want Donaldson, which is making his value go up, obviously. Uh, he stated, according to Ken Rosenthal earlier this year, that he wants to come back to the Braves. And a bit of a shift of what we've heard previously on the subject, it's not the years that are separating the Atlanta Braves from reunion with the hot corner slugger. It is about the competitive bidding market. As with virtually every other free agent of significance who has already signed this winter, we could see Josh Donaldson get much more out of his next contract than anybody had anticipated. And guys, let's be honest, the guy earned it. If the Braves don't get him and he gets millions and millions more than what the Braves wanted to pay him, he earned it this year. I mean, he had a heck of a year. 37 homers, and it, nobody believed in him. No team believed in him, which is probably why the Braves got such a good one-year deal. This is, No, this is what Jim Bowden said this morning on MLB Network Radio. I have a source on the Donaldson side that has told me the Braves have gone to four years, but my understanding is that both the Nationals and the Braves, along with the Twins, have all gone to four years. So now... It's basically going to be who pays the highest price. Unless Donaldson decides to take a hometown discount, it's no secret. He's from Alabama. He's from right here in the South. I'm sure he'd much rather play in the South. Uh, he wants to come back to the Braves, but the Braves have got to fork over the cash to get him. Uh, I've, met, I've had videos on this for the past two weeks now. I had Nolan Arenado I posted 10 minutes ago. He's a possibility. Uh, Chris Bryant has been rumored. A lot of guys. Anthony Rendon for a short stint before he signed with the Angels was a possibility. Uh, a lot of third basemen are seemingly on the market, but if we could land Donaldson, that would be a very good thing for the Atlanta Braves. Uh, Bowden apparently suggested this was a single source, unconfirmed by either team or the player directly. Com you, uh, obviously, you'll never get those confirmations uh, while negotiations are in play. Um, again, this is just a report. Cannot confirm any of it. Uh, Bowden also raised the specter that the ceiling for Donaldson's services isn't the $25 million annual rate that seems to have been assumed. So he, everybody, I think, thought this would be about a $25 million a year, $100 million four-year contract. It's looking like it's going to be $112 for four years, uh, $28 million annually, maybe $125 million, $25 million for five years. If, if all these teams are competing... Uh, at a four-year rate, what happens when a team throws in five? Does he want more annually, or does he want another year? And, oh, well, Bowden questions the same thing. Um, so that's that's pretty much all of it. If you want to go check it out, it's on TomahawkTake.com. It's very interesting. Uh, they actually had an article an hour ago talking about that the Braves need to draw a line in the sand and figure out what they're going to do. I've been saying that for two weeks now. You can go check out my other videos. Make sure to hit the bell for notifications and like and subscribe, and uh, I will see you next time. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope the Braves bring back Josh Donaldson.